Hello and welcome to ESPN Quick Info Dailies. I'm Ronald Kapoor with the top cricket news this Monday. First up, Mushfiqur Rahim leads Bangladesh to their first ever T20I win over India. New Zealand beat England in the second T20I at Wellington. And Australia captain Aaron Finch unhappy with the 20-minute innings break after a rain-hit game against Pakistan in Sydney. Starting off with the result of the first T20I between India and Bangladesh at Delhi and Mushfiqur Rahim's unbeaten half-century led the visitors to a seven-wicket win at the Arun Jaitley Stadium to register a historic first-ever win for Bangladesh against India in T20Is. Mushfiqur's 60 not out of 43 balls had its moments of fortune, but the former Bangladesh captain made India pay for their mistakes to effectively seal the chase in the 19th over of Khalil Ahmed, where he hit four boundaries of four balls. Earlier on, Bangladesh's all-round bowling display restricted India to just 148 for 6 from their 20 overs. Shikhar Dhawan top scoring with 41 of 42 balls. Two more T20I results and New Zealand bounced back after going down in the first T20I against England to win the second match by 21 runs at Wellington. After being put into bat first by Owen Morgan, New Zealand were powered to 176 for 8, courtesy quick-fire 40s from Martin Guptill at the top of the innings and Jimmy Neesham towards the end. In response, New Zealand struck at regular intervals to dent England's chase. Mitchell Santner's 3 for 25, earning him a Player of the Match award and setting up a 21 run win for the hosts. The win sees New Zealand level the five match T20I series 1 1, with the third T20I to be played at Nelson on November the 5th. And finally, with news from the third T20 International that was played on Sunday, and Australia captain Aaron Finch has criticised the 20-minute innings break that effectively cost her side the chance to win the series opener against Pakistan at Sydney. The T20I was abandoned 11 balls before the second innings constituted a game, with Australia well ahead in the chase. Australia were none for 41 after 3.1 overs when rain returned and there was no chance for the match to resume before the cut-off time. The Pakistan innings had been interrupted by a lengthy stoppage after 12.4 overs and then resumed for 14 deliveries before the standard break between innings was taken. Finch himself was leading Australia's response and had just hit Mohammad Irfan for 25 runs from the third over of the innings. And given the shortened game already due to prior interruptions, the Aussie captain believed a full 20-minute innings break did not make much sense to him.